hi 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 all right hi Feroz viewers it's a day after I'm at in Pasadena uh, I'm at is a makeup show it's open to the public so I hope that you've heard about it researched it and decided to go yesterday I uh, can't wait to see your video updates and all the stuff that you got but I got a few things and I'm excited to show them to you today uh, I think it's important especially if you want to do makeup and hair if there's a trade show especially when you're in the beginning of your career to go and check it out because the big companies and big names usually show up great deals great deals um, plus there's tons of information uh, where you can take classes so I'm just gonna show you what I bought then I'm gonna show you I took some video at the makeup show and I loved loved it it was such a good time uh, so what did I buy the first thing I did honestly was I came in the door and Mac Pro was there so what Mac Pro is is the professional department of Mac makeup so if you're a professional makeup artist um, you can create an account and you receive discounts on all everything Mac all Mac products um, I applied I'm a Mac Pro member and when I applied I did mine by snail mail so it took forever for me to become a Mac Pro member I think it took me over a month to become a Mac Pro member. What they were doing yesterday, if you went to the show and you brought your credentials with you, um, for example, you might need a cosmetology license, a nail technician license, a certificate from a makeup school. If you've been published your tear sheet, you would need to bring that with you to the show, fill out the application, show it to them, and they were giving you your Mac Pro membership and giving you the discount right there so you didn't have to wait. I was so envious because I had to wait like four weeks for mine. So that was a great, great thing they were doing. So Mac Pro happened to be there. First thing I did was I went to the Mac counter and I only bought three things <clears throat> from Mac. I bought a pigment. I just learned how to use pigments, yes. I just learned how to use pigments. Um, I really didn't understand them. I bought them once and they were so loose and messy I never used them again, but I understand them now so I bought pigments. Um, I also bought the mixing medium for the pigments um, so that I can use it dry or wet. Great mixing medium. And finally, I got a 2 Max 217 brush. I needed this brush. Great for eyeshadows. So that's the first thing I did. I headed over to the matte counter. Then, I, as everyone knows, if you watched my videos, I love Temp 2. So I headed over to Temp 2 and I just kind of picked up stuff I didn't have. They have two makeup face lines. They have the SB and they have the Aqua. I did not have the Aqua, so I picked up the Aqua. Let me tell you, I'm wearing it right now and I love it. Um, so I got the Aqua Trial Foundations because I like to try things out in the small packs first before I buy them. I got the Dora Billions and Ice, and as we remember, all the Dora lines cannot be used in the face, so this is great for adding shimmer to skin, body painting, de body designs, tattoos. This has uh, all the glitters, I love it. Then I bought the blush and shimmer in the Aqua, which I did not have, so I have that now. There is a blush in here that I have on right now that is so amazing. And what I love is the feel of Aqua. Aqua is very, very matte. It is the closest of the Temp2 lines, because they have Dura line, Aqua line, and SB. Aqua is the closest one that finishes like traditional makeup. Very matte, matte finish. I love the way it went on. I loved how easy it was to clean my airbrush after I used it. Loved it so much. I always use white um, airbrush to kind of make my eyeshadow stand out so I put this underneath my eyeshadow so I just bought a big bottle because I needed it <laughs> then I bought uh, the mixing medium they look alike I bought mixing medium um, because what you can do with your MAC pigments is with your MAC pigment you can mix it small amount in your airbrush and have it come out however you have to have a mixing medium for that to happen so you take a small amount of your MAC, some of your mixing medium, you mix it together in your airbrush and voila you have this amazing color and design which is great because now that opens up a whole new world and you can kind of combine your classic makeup and use it with your airbrush system. 
I brought lip tars from OCC. They seem to be the big thing. Uh, I kind of went, a lot of them had sold out, so I just bought a lip tar. Lip tar is vintage. I loved it. It's a deep um, blood burgundy color. Love it, love it, love it. I have to say that these are lipsticks, from what I understand, I've read an article, that they've melted down and they go on lip, lip gloss. Then over time, they dry, they can dry and matte. Now, good thing about lip tars is you can mix them together. So if you bought more than one or you bought the whole line, you can mix them together to get different colors. That's where it opens up all the possibilities for you. Um, as a makeup artist, this is more of the boring stuff, but I bought a mud palette, makeup designer, and a uh, scoop. And what you do is you would use your pigments Scoop out a little, especially if you're working with different people, you kind of don't want to dip your brush in and contaminate your product. So you want to kind of take out. You can use a Petri dish, but I am going to use a palette. I'm going to set this down and you can mix anything, not just pigments, lipsticks on this palette. So I knew it that I needed that because I'll, I'll use my hand a lot, the back of my hand. So no more back of the hand, right here. And last, but no, not last, I bought, um, Kryolan brush cleaner, brush cleaner because I need a brush cleaner. Kryolan is a huge makeup company. They have great eyeshadows, great lipsticks. Uh, they're huge in theater and they also have an airbrush system. There's so many airbrush systems at uh, IMATS yesterday. It was amazing. My favorite thing that I bought yesterday, my Feroche viewers, was this brush, 20 set brush set. I don't know if it can fit in the, I'll try to show it to you, but check that out 20 brushes everything you would ever need it came in one pack one set which is so hard to find I kind of wish Mac would do that they do very small sets this is a 20 piece brush set of everything you need um, only $90 $90 um, so I can't wait, and that's why I brought the brush cleaner because I have now all these brushes that I can use. It has everything from, I found your powder brush. I have not taken them out of the plastic yet. So it has everything from a powder brush to, I have a small foundation brush and I have a bigger foundation brush. I mean, your blush brushes, everything you need. Um, all the way down to eyeshadow and then lip brushes and even eyebrows. So that is my iMats haul. I'm excited to go look at the videos on YouTube, see what else um, people purchase. I was hoping to see some YouTube um, gurus at the iMats show, um, but I just had a great time. Great place to find out about makeup classes. Great place to get started in makeup. Um, there's iMats all over the world, Toronto, London, LA, and there's makeup shows all over the world. Go on Google, check them out, especially if you're interested in makeup and want to make it a career. This is a great way to go and see companies get great discounts. And so I took some video footage at IMAX and check, 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 check it out.